Guys, please make sure you stay until the end. One common mistake that people often make can cost you thousands of dollars in repairs, parts, diagnostics that you may actually not even need. Stay with us, we'll explain what we're talking about. Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repair Life. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be super helpful video to any of you guys having a Chevy Tahoe or Chevy Suburban that generation here from year 2000 and 14 to year 2020. If you need to find where the BCM, that's the body control module fuses and relays are located, where you can find them, they will be in different fuse boxes. We'll talk about that. We'll explain where you can buy cheap parts, tools, fuses, relays with a good price, quick shipping. That way, you do not waste money and time. All that will be covered absolutely free for your convenience please make sure to stay until the end so before we start guys let us tell you a little bit about us every single car we get here at the garage we try to make at least two to three hundred free repair videos we take them guys completely apart we show you how to fix engines transmissions bodywork guys engine codes transmission codes fuses relays uh, as well guys why we do all that because our mission in the shop is to save as much money as we can all we need in return please subscribe to the channel like the video that way we can keep making these free videos guys we have more than 15,000 free repair videos on our YouTube channels that can save you thousands of dollars in future repairs and if you guys need to buy any parts to use a good price quick shipping that way do not waste money and time we'll put the link in the description of the video below for your convenience please check it out the BCM body control module fuses and relays where you can expect to find them guys will be working by the way in two different fuse boxes where they're located first Chevy Tahoe and Suburban are built on the same platform so it should guys work for both just the Suburban is a little bit longer go ahead and open that driver door then on the side of the dash here you see you have a cover guys pull that cover out behind it you have a fuse box with a layout like this one here before we continue let's explain quickly why it's always a good idea to test fuses and relays it is guys very important to test fuses and relays on those fuses you cannot clearly see if they're burnt or not especially you can see in the jk's fuses as well and if you guys assume okay you, let's say you remove a fuse you look at it and you assume guys that it's a, actually a, a good fuse but it's actually a bad fuse sometimes you cannot clearly see that what can easily happen guys at that point uh, you can uh, uh, put the bad fuse in and you start replacing parts and tools that you don't need to so you lose your time you lose your money to fix a problem that doesn't exist when all we had to do is test the fuse and replace it we'll put a link to a special video that will teach you how to test fuses how to check relays very easily as well guys so uh, check it out it will be in the description of the video below here guys we need to check three different fuses then we need to go to a different fuse box and we need to check even more and where they are located now so if we zoom in a little bit so we can clearly see now the first one is known as fuse number 10 so fuse number 10 will be the 20 amp fuse right here very important fuse then check fuse number 11 as well these two fuses 10 and 11 then you need to check fuse number 19 19 is right underneath guys okay right there that's the fuse that you will need to check then you need to guys okay come to the passenger side open the passenger door on the side of the dash you have the same cover like on the driver side remove it and you're going to find another fuse box here so here guys we need to check more things okay and you wonder which ones now fuse number 13 is one of them it's a 20 amp fuse again check that one you need to check again fuse number 19 so fuse number 19 okay that will be this fuse right here 20 amp fuse then you need to check fuse number 38 so 38 guys okay will be that fuse right here next you need to check fuse number uh, uh fuse number 46 okay if you come in that row of fuses here this is 46 and fuse number 47 this will need to be checked 
Now if you're looking for BCM relay, you don't have one guys, those fuses are known as relay fuses so if you have problem with the BCM body control module, check these fuses first. So guys, I want to show you now something, okay check this thing out, you have all different kinds of fuses, fuses, relays, circuit breakers, something that could be really hard to find and if you're in the middle of nowhere, you don't have a replacement one, you may end up being stuck guys in the middle of nowhere or they can be seriously overpriced, so what we do? We usually buy some spare ones, we put in the glove box for a peace of mind. We'll put the link in the description of the video below where you can get them at a good price, quick shipping. That way you do not waste money and time. Hopefully the video will be helpful. Thank you for watching and see you guys next time.